YouTube, I got another video, video for y'all. Um, this is basically letting y'all know um, if y'all was able, to, if y'all wasn't able to co um, comment on any of my videos, the last four or five videos, something like that, I apologize. Um, didn't realize that I couldn't do it. I, I didn't. I just didn't get a chance to really look through the YouTube. But just just now, but my lady told me yesterday, like I can't. She couldn't comment, and um. I went to um to go look at it and YouTube got some new settings on there that I didn't realize or maybe I was just doing something I don't know the point is that it works now um let me know can y'all please let me know if y'all could comment or not I appreciate it also I'm gonna give y'all a little run of what happened today or, or nothing really happened but tell you when I, the video I showed y'all yesterday of me getting there early, dropping off that low, whatever, which is the day before. Was it the day before? Yeah, cause I end up. Yeah. So yesterday, the day before, where I made that video, such and such. Then that's the day after that, which was was Friday. I drove. I picked up this load. Oh yeah, I was right. Yeah, I was right. I picked this load early and I shut down at a TA. Then I um went to go pick up this load at a um in New Jersey. Where the load I was supposed to pick up, they ended up not having a product. And um and my dispatcher was able to find me another load with, with some good mileage, basically eight hundred some miles. So right now I'm I'm in Indianapolis. So I picked up a load from this place in Jersey called RST. Is it RST? Which is probably like the worst ship I ever been to yet because it was. It was well. Then it's Jersey. You think about Jersey, just like New York. It was um ridiculously tight. Where's my little book? I want to see the name of it so I can let y'all know all the drivers that go there, prepare them, prepare them for the madness. Cause even um even dropping off the empty was a task. Even dropping off the empty was a task, bro. Dropping off the empty, I had to leave in the middle of the... Because nowhere to put it. It's, it's so crowded there. And it was a high-value load. It must have been closed or something like that. Because I dropped it at Home Goods, which I'm supposed to be getting another load again tomorrow. That's like a thousand-something miles. Starting off the week pretty good. So, it's in New Bergen. New Bergen, New Jersey. It's called NRT. So if y'all have to go to NRT in Jersey, be prepared for the madness in there. It's it's ridiculous. I end up just dropping the trailer in the middle of the aisle, let the yard dogs do to that. You know what I'm saying? You gotta be smart, man. Don't put yourself in a situation where you gotta hit somebody trailer or you gotta just be you when you go to shippers, you wanna be in and out. If it's gonna be mad difficult or you gotta do mad work just to drop drop in a uh drop a, a empty in. Into a little spot to pick up a load. Cause I found my load. It was always in the back. But there was nowhere to put the empty. So I just dropped the empty right in the middle. Let the yard dog take care of that. Dropped my load. Picked up my load and kept it moving. Matter of fact, they were so lazy that they, they left my trailer so low. I had to jack it up just to try to get under it. Even if I had dropped the bags on my truck. I still couldn't even get in there. Like It was, it was ridiculous. And then when it's low like that. And the truck, the, the trailer is loaded. It's really, really hard to try to get it up. So you gotta put it in one gear and you gonna be basically turning that damn lever forever. I forgot what it's called, the crank. The crank handle, you gonna be turning that forever just to get it up. It's, one, it's definitely a workout, you be tired after that. But anywho, got that done. So now I'm in Indianapolis, just dropped off this load. I am exhausted, drove from last night from 12 a.m. Till now, pretty much. I only had like 30 minutes left on my clock. Um, got to the ship out here, Home Goods, and uh, and Browns, Brownsbury, Indiana, Brownsbury, Indiana, and they slow as hell too, cause then we got one security guard doing everything, and he look like he can't hardly move. So, way to do that, that was killing my clock, all that. So I, I even though, even though, when your time is low, low, no matter if you go off duty or not, it's going to run out. So I was, you know, I was using my purse, my PC, and came to this love that's like an exit away and shutting out for the night. And that's what I'm doing. So um, that's the update. That's what's going on with that. Um, 
Of course, they didn't have no empty there. <laughs> but they did find me empty. I just got to drive to it. It's like 80 miles away. I'll pick it up in the morning after my whatever time I get up and go decide to do it. Because I got all day to get this load. That is alive. So I should probably get there early as possible. I'll probably get there like around 6. It's going to be a Sunday. Hopefully, well, they do have some westerns in the door. Hopefully, they will have a, a loaded trailer for me. We see what happens tomorrow. And, um, yeah. Yeah, I end up just giving y'all the whole day of what's going on with me. But that's fine. You know, I like telling y'all what's going on. You know, everybody that's getting into this truck and stuff. You know, these, like, just everyday stuff, you know. I like what I'm doing, by the way. And I think you should want, like, what you're doing. It's pretty cool, you know what I'm saying? But, um, yeah, man, please let me know if y'all able to comment. That's the, that's the reason why we made this video out of, you know, talking extra. <laughs> um, comment, like, and subscribe, all that good stuff, and share, and talk to y'all later. One.